Manuel from Taiwan here. I'm going to show you how someone could cast their screen into your VBoard application. So this is my VBoard application. I've signed in to my VBoard and now I'm going to turn on my casting feature. So I turn it on and now let's pretend I have a colleague abroad in Australia or in another room or somewhere far and he's going to sign in to his myviewboard.com account and he's going to click on send my screen to a view board. So he's going to download first a uh, Chrome plugin that is needed in order to have the casting feature turned on. So once he installed it, he can now find me using my vboard name. My vboard name is ViewSonic. So big V, big S, ViewSonic, as you can see here. So once he begins sharing, I will see his name right here pop up. So now what this is saying is, do you want to allow Chassel to access and share his screen onto my view board? I say yes. So I click on him and now he'll start his presentation. Can you share your PowerPoint please? All right. So this is the PowerPoint that Chassel is presenting to us. And let's say again that he's somewhere abroad in another room in another city. <laughs> so now he can uh, broadcast his screen onto our view board. So here it is, whatever he writes over there, whatever he presents over there, I could see here. And I could even annotate over it. The bird, I could take a snapshot, and I could see the snapshot in the other screen. Here, here. So you could annotate over the presentations that he shares with us. That was it.